The inconvenience for commuters starts on Saturday, July the 7th, right in the middle of school holidays and will continue for a total of 11 days next month. Now, the maintenance work will take place on the track between Glen Waverley and Darling stations. Now, even though it's happening on that small section of the track, most of the line will be affected with buses replacing trains between Glen Waverley and Burnley stations. Now, passengers can expect to add at least another 12 minutes to their journey. The Blitz in July is uh, going to replace 45,000 wooden sleepers with new concrete sleepers and the associated ballast works that go with that. That will give a much smoother ride. It'll give a more reliable railway. It'll affect all the people that travel on the Glen Waverley line, so that's about uh, 25,000 people a day. So, Emily, what has the Premier had to say about the timing of the shutdown? Well, Mal, the Premier says it's a disruption passengers are simply going to have to bear. Now, he says this maintenance work, which includes replacing 45,000 sleepers and rewiring, needs to happen now to prevent future problems similar to the sort of meltdown we saw on the system yesterday. None of that uh, is particularly sexy, but it's absolutely essential. These works are essential to maintain the system. And uh, these are pretty tough economic times. Nevertheless, we're making that investment. Now, the government is really hoping that people that usually use the Glen Waverley line do jump on those buses provided instead of getting into their, into their cars because the last thing they want is for people to clog up the already overburdened road network.